Now on WSAR's Breakfast Club, it's the Bristol Community College Update. A monthly visit with President Laura Douglas on 1480 WSAR and 95.9 FM. Sponsored by Bristol Community College. Dreams within reach. Visit bristolcc.edu. All right, 847. Good to have you along on a Friday. You're going to spend a couple of moments with our good friend Laura Douglas, president of Bristol Community College. Laura, good morning. How are you? Good morning. Happy heck. How are you? Did you have a great 4th of July? I did indeed. How about yours? Was it good as well? Absolutely. There's no better place to spend the 4th of July than here in the South Coast. It's uh, just beautiful, isn't it? Oh, the weather was just outstanding, so we are very fortunate with all of that. And I know you continue to be busy, busy, busy at uh, at Bristol Community College. And this morning, we're going to spend a couple of moments uh, uh, talking about something that could be incredibly important for kids and and their career opportunities. Uh, students who uh, who check out this uh, this uh, what you're offering, uh, uh, known as a CTE, Bristol Community College's Career. At, and technical in education career certificates. Maybe break that down for us and, and how it all plays in the, in the role as far as uh, helping students achieve uh, where they want to go. Yeah, so I'd love to talk about our CTE, which stands for Career and Technical Education. And um, we provide so many different career certificates in essential, um, you know, in-demand areas. So, so many people think that going to college is a two-year degree or a four-year degree, but we have a lot of one-year certificates and even shorter-term certificates. Like this summer in Taunton, we're doing a phlebotomy certificate. Um, and, you know, you're in and out and done in, in a short period of time. And, you know, I think the most important thing that we should start with today in talking about these short-term certificates is that the demand is very high. High. The cost is very low, a demand in, in terms of students. Students really like these because they can take, uh, you know, it's a short, short term and they can go right into the job market. And then they can even kind of parlay these certificates um, and uh, kind of place them into degree programs later on and continue on their education to even grow their careers. But, you know, right now a lot of people are thinking, well, I don't know if I need to go to school. Wages are high, you know, blah, blah, blah. But, you know, we see the economy, you know, starting to erode in many places. Uh, recession, is, uh, recession is being predicted by many economists. And this is a time when, pe when people with, the, with lower skills are the ones who are first to be let go um, in, the, uh, in any type of um, uh, layoffs. So if, if you don't have skills and you're listening out there, this is a really good time to be thinking about how you're going to recession-proof uh, yourself so that you can um, be ready for perhaps a downturn that's coming um, in our economy. So um, our, our students that are, are in these programs, uh, they are eligible for financial financial aid, um, but there's, you know, I think it's important to talk about the kinds of certificates that might be available. So, for example, phlebotomy, that's, you know, drawing blood and uh, working in clinical laboratories and hospitals, um, you know, and uh, really it's, it's, it's short term and you can be out and working in no time. Uh, we have our uh, Portuguese and Spanish um, community interpreting. Those are also great careers in this community, whether they're in the medical field or judicial, uh, web design, something. If those people, some people are looking to work from home, that's a great career to work from home. Uh, but also things like substance abuse, counseling, paralegal and legal studies, office administration, graphic design, human services. Those are all very viable certificates in today's economy. Mm -hmm. well, let me ask you, what, what's the time frame? Is it a six months? Uh, uh course is it a year or two what, what what break that down for us yeah it could be it could be uh, several weeks and it could be up to a year uh, so for example um, I'll, I'll give one example which is a, a our off, offshore wind um, certificate it's for offshore wind uh, technician that is a um, one-year certificate uh, and uh, 
and you know students who complete that are able to uh, prepare for some of the great jobs that are coming in offshore wind and actually something else I'd love to add about this we have a very generous donor who's underwriting the cost of the offshore wind technician and the offshore wind associate degree program so uh, if we have folks out there that are interested in this obviously financial aid is available but beyond that uh, students could practically uh, uh, be educated in these two fields for free so um, lots of opportunity uh, there so uh, really check it out we've got a lot if there's a, a field that you're particularly interested in um, the listeners out there if they're thinking hmm I'd like to learn a little bit more about graphic design they should give the college a call and and speak to an advisor and learn how uh, that could be achieved whether it's a full-time certificate or, or going part-time all right. And, you know, of course, it, the timing is, a, is absolutely a, a perfect with the job market as wide open as it, as it is. Uh, folks are looking for help everywhere. And so this is a good way to kind of cut to the chase, get, to, get the uh, education you need with those certificates and then move on, I guess. Right. Yeah. And, you know, we see a lot of companies, you know, you start with a certificate, you get in the door. Let's say you study phlebotomy and you go to one of our local hospitals. They have tuition reimbursement programs. So, you know, you get a good job as a phlebotomist and then perhaps what you do is um, take advantage of tuition reimbursement and continue your college classes for free. So many different opportunities to get a college degree and, and have a great career at the same time. All right. That's excellent. Thank you, uh, President Laura Douglas, Bristol Community College. Great to hear your voice again, and I hope you have a great summer, and I'm sure we'll speak again uh, either next month or in the fall sometime. I hope we'll hear, we'll be talking to each other soon. Bye-bye, right. Take care. Have a great weekend. Thank